Hello there guys, it's me, Daily, and today I'm gonna share to you how to mod Blast Rifle for PvP and at the same time I'll give a little bit of a gun review about it so that you know you have a little bit of background about how to use it and what it can do for you in PvP just in case you haven't tried it yet so first let's check what I have as mods in my Radiant Solstice Blast Rifle so this is from an event uh, I don't know it was a December event but I wasn't playing back then yet this was uh, given to me by a friend uh, Svarter so let's see what mods I have here let's just click on uh, yeah that so I have an external recoil reduction versus a melee mod so it's kinda obvious we go for the reduction of recoil and a T5 power bore you can get this from Chimera or Paradise and for the magazine this is actually the secret of blast rifles instead of getting a high cap magazine you'd like to get a controlled burst magazine for it so that is one of the uh, factors that makes a blast rifle really push more damage in less time and finally for the scope we use a stabilization sight so with this setup all right with this setup this is how the sight looks like it just uh, increases your movement accuracy at the same time it increases your uh, accuracy as well so this is the movement accuracy at play okay stabilization side and if you zoom you don't have anything messing with your view so that is stabilization side now let's take a look at another blast rifle that I have let's check this experimental blue blast rifle that I've been playing with for a bit right now so if we check the um the mods that I have there it's the same it, it got external recall reduction plus power bore which gives a damage uh, boost the control burst magazine the only difference right now is that I have a tactical scope so what does tactical scope do well let's check here tactical scope so a tactical scope would increase your scope higher all right so if we see that's it you zoom uh, closer let's check the other weapon this is the stabilization site in action and this is the tactical scope in action all right now just for experimental purposes I'd be getting uh, another type of scope and that is the commander scope it's a mid power scope and this is the assault scope so we have two more options let's try this uh, command scope first and then we'll try this assault scope okay so command scope let's buy this and insert it to our uh, blast rifle it's a mazu but I think it will uh, give us the same uh, 
idea about how this could play out. Okay, so command and scope. Let's see. So this is how a command and scope would look like. So first, a little review again. That's the tactical scope, and this is the stabilization side. That is our default mod, by the way, stabilization side. Okay, let's try that other blast rifle, that has a blast rifle. So, yeah. It's a pretty good scope, you know, this uh, command scope. I've seen low carb play with a command scope if I'm not mistaken during a what they call this expedition. So now let's try an assault scope. So again, yeah, this is the command scope. I think it's pretty good, guys. Yeah, I'm gonna try this later. But for uh, Study purposes, let's put another scope there. Where is it? Yeah, there we go. Let's try assault scope. Okay, so this is how an, asco an assault scope would look like. So it's like, it's like a stabilization site. Okay, except that it doesn't reduce your, or, you know, make your uh, movement sight or targeting better. Because here you have movement accuracy. Okay. But if you look at assault scope, it's just aim accuracy. So, yeah. So it makes your bullets tighter when aiming. So if you ask me, well, what would I use just in case? Let's see. Assault scope. Provide zoom without it's obscuring the field of view. Versus uh, a commander scope. I think I'd go with a commander scope for now. We'll try this, but for a blast rifle, what you want is this. Okay, this is the default one. You want the stabilization side, okay? So we'll get this command scope, just to test. And of course, we'll get a controlled burst mag. Controlled burst mag. Um... The default would be power bore to increase your damage, but I'll be using a Mazu. So when using a Mazu, my perception is that it's more effective if you zoom it. So I guess I'll go with fall of distance just to try and hit the enemy on a, you know, far range, further range than usual. So let's see how this plays out. We'll be putting this uh, mods here in a blast rifle. Okay. This gun's actually the mo the the blast rifle versus the Mazu blast rifle. I think the the Mazu is like the a crazier version, okay? It's the crazier horse among the two when it comes to movement accuracy. Well, I'm gonna sh show you in a little bit so that you can appreciate it. Let me just put this mod in place, okay? So yeah, as I was saying, if you look at the Mazu blast rifle and if you shoot, it's really spread out. You can see the 
target it's really spread out okay your crosshair but if you look at the regular blast rifle yeah the movement crosshair is smaller so you can really hit a more concentrated area if you're uh, moving unlike the mazu the only thing about mazu is that it doesn't change when you jump but with a regular blast rifle look at that when you jump it actually spreads out so yeah that's the difference so this is just a theory for now but i think mazu would be better off if you uh, zoom it shoot it while zooming okay oh wait did i put the right uh scope here i'm not sure if i placed the right scope Well, I was hoping I would be, uh, yeah. Let's get a commander scope here. I'm gonna try commander scope. So again, if you are gonna use a blast rifle, the default would be stabilization sight, okay? stabilization side here there you go so this is the commander scope it's really concentrated okay I like it now we will be uh, changing a bit of our setup here we'll try this out in uh, PvP room just wait a minute yeah, let's use our usual white ranger with this Mazu. Okay, um, I'm gonna unequip this one. And equip live wire and electrical fire. Okay, guys, we're gonna try to PvP with our Mazu right now. So, see you there and wish me luck